Hey there, the Nature Geek here, and what's all the buzz about today? The cicada killer wasp. Now you may think that I'm crazy laying this close to one of the largest wasp species in the United States, but I'm in no danger right now. Once you get to know the life history of this wasp, you might find it more fascinating than fearful. You'll start to see cicada killers in mid-July, around the same time when their cicada prey are also emerging. The males emerge first, with the females emerging about two weeks later. With cicada killer populations dependent upon cicadas, you might wonder if the number of cicada killers skyrockets when we get the mass hatching of those 13 and 17 year cicadas. Unfortunately for the cicada killer, those types of cicadas emerge in May and June and die off by mid-July, just before the wasps emerge. Female cicada killers lay their eggs in underground burrows, favoring southeast-facing, well-drained slopes with lots of large deciduous trees nearby. The dry soil is best for burrow digging, and the large trees are good places to hunt for cicadas. Females dig their burrows up to three feet long and two feet below the ground and will contain several chambers to lay a single egg in. The female cicada killer will put one to two cicadas in each of these chambers on which the young will feed as they develop. The number of cicadas in each chamber is not random. It depends on the sex of the young inside. Female cicada killers have the ability to choose the sex of each egg before it's laid. Because females are twice as big as males, they require more food for development than males. So if a male egg is to be laid, the female must collect one cicada. However, if a female egg is to be laid, she must collect two cicadas. You gentlemen always knew that females were more costly, didn't you? If you have cicada killers taking up residence in your backyard, think twice before breaking out the flamethrower. Cicada killers are a beneficial insect. Not only do they act as pollinators, as the adults only consume nectar and tree sap, but they are an effective form of pest control as well. Some cicadas are known to damage deciduous trees by laying their eggs under the bark of new branches. In a single month, 100 female cicada killers will remove over 16,000 cicadas from the trees surrounding their burrows. Cicada killer wasps may look like something to be feared, but if you learn a little bit more about them, you'll see that they're actually incredibly fascinating. Now, if I was doing what uh, Mr. Nature Geek is doing over there, I might really have to fear the wrath of an angry wasp. <laughs> see you next time. I think.